Yo, what's going on everybody? In today's video, we're going to be showing you the top 3 outfit glitches in GTA Online. These are super simple and should work on all consoles, all platforms. If this does help you out and you do find yourself coming back here often, please make sure you subscribe as it does help us out a ton. And also a massive shout out to all the new subs. Yeah, so for this one we'll be showing you how to get the black joggers, a uh, gun belt on any outfit, and the black duffel bag. So and I hope that this being said, and I hope without further ado, also, real quick before we get into the video, thanks to U4GM for sponsoring this video. They offer all sorts of modded accounts, billion and trillion cash, high RP levels, modded cars, modded outfits, and fast run. If you're interested, check out the link in the description for more services. And also, do not forget to use my code Weezy for 5% off when you're checking out. Alrighty, guys, hope you enjoy. Back to the video. So, head over into the back of your MOC and then head over to your mobile operations terminal. And you want to go in there and you want to start up a mission called Work Dispute. There is a few missions you have to do when before you unlock the Work Dispute mission. But it is a little bit of a grind, but I mean, they're well worth it for the joggers, they're pretty cool. So, um, yeah, if you have that unlocked, start that up and uh, invite a friend. If you're not sure uh, of people to play with, then uh, join up my Discord. I'll be, uh, there will be heaps of people in there to uh, help you out with this mission. So when you do start this mission up, if you start the mission, you get the black joggers. If you join the mission, you get the red joggers. So if you can find someone on the Discord or have a friend that has this mission unlocked, you get them to start it up and do the exact same thing that I show you in this video. But when you join, instead of having the black joggers on, you'll have the red joggers on. So when you load in, you should see you have the black joggers on and the person to your right will have the red joggers on. So what you want to do is you want to make your way over to your apartment. Now this won't show up on your map, you just, you have to know where your apartment is. <laughs> I mean the game's been out for quite some time, hopefully, hopefully you know where it is by now. So make your way to your apartment. Once you get over to your apartment, if you just walk into the blue circle, it won't let you in. So you just want to blow yourself up. Then once you respawn, you'll be able to walk straight into your apartment. So yep, now we've respawned, we'll just run straight over to our apartment and uh, save the outfit. Just make sure your teammate doesn't die or you don't, uh, you don't die again because this only works for uh, if you're on normal difficulty for one person. If you put it on easy, then both players can do it, so you have two team lives. But yeah, just be aware of that. So once you load it into your apartment, it's basically the tail end of the glitch. You can uh, go save the outfit, and that'll be yours to change up and keep, and make whatever modded black outfits you want to make with it. As mentioned, this also does work for the red joggers, so for the red joggers just join and do the exact same thing. And uh, yeah, you'll have the red joggers. So yeah, these are the real black joggers, so we can change the shoes and get the floating ankles, change the top. But yeah, if you change the pants, you'll obviously lose the pants, so make sure you don't do that. <laughs> uh, yeah, so you can go back over to your outfit and equip your black joggers. So first off, you want to head over to any clothing store and make sure you're wearing the outfit that you want the belt on. Then head over to the top section and go to utility vests and equip number 43, the peach plate carrier. When you save the outfit, make sure you don't have any helmet or mask on. After you have the outfit with the peach plate carrier, you want to go head over to the outfit section and go to heist coveralls and grab one of these bottom four. Any with the gas mask will be fine. From there, we're just going to merge this gas mask outfit to our outfit we saved with the peach plate carrier. So just head over to the pier and do the telescope glitch. So if you're not sure what the telescope glitch is, all you have to do is just have that fumigator outfit on, run past spamming right on the d-pad, and then hot open your interaction menu, and just change your outfit to the one you saved. So as you can see, the gas mask has merged with our outfit. You can head over to the mask store to save it, but usually with this glitch I like to head over to the gun store because it makes it a bit quicker for the next part. So once you're over there, just save the outfit. And once you've done that, just go into your pause menu, go to play job, Rockstar created, and start. It's a titan of a job. So 
So once the job is started, because we're already at the gun store, you can just save the outfit here. So once we load back in, your outfit should look like this, with the chest plate disappeared. Now you just want to equip any outfit with a belt. If you don't have a belt, I have a video on the card above on how to get an outfit with a belt. From there you just want to start up, it's a G thing. It's bookmarked in the pinned comment below. From there you will need to invite a friend and make sure you have your settings set to player saved outfits. And once you've loaded in, you just want to switch over to the outfit you saved. Once you load in, just wait a couple seconds and leave the job. When you load back into free mode, you still see you have the outfit with the belt on. So you want to register as a CEO and then go to the nearest streetcar. When you register as a CEO, you want to open up your interaction menu before you get into the car and make sure you just hover over style. And when you get in, change your CEO style, one to the right, then one back to the left and get out of the car. From there, you'll see your gun belt has merged with your outfit. From here, you can save the outfit and put on helmets and duffel bags, masks. Alright, so first thing you're going to want to do is head over to your Terabyte and go over to the touchscreen. While registered as a CEO, open up this and uh, you want to head over to Client Jobs. In here there will be a job called Robbery in Progress and you want to start that up. So once that starts up, you've got to go back to the computer and scan all the cameras to find out where it's at. So just flick through the cameras and find whereabouts your robbery is. So once you find it, just scroll around until the option for the going to the interior comes up. Once you've found your robbery, I find the easiest way just to jump on an impressor and fly over to where it is. So when we get over there, there is a couple people, but the oppressor can handle them pretty easily. And uh, also when you walk in there, there will be a juggernaut that spawns. So be mindful of that. And uh, what I usually do is just sit here on the oppressor and just pump rockets inside <laughs> until, uh, until they're gone. And now they've been handled, you should be able to run inside and grab your duffel bag. So from here, all you need to do is just lose the police and head over to the destination that's given to you on the map. But when you head over to the destination, you'll need to be mindful of not just flying straight into the circle. You'll need to jump off your oppressor and land and parachute into the yellow circle. Yeah, just like this. If you are having trouble with parachuting, you can hold L1 and R1 or both your bumpers to make it a little bit easier and more controllable. So we're not done just yet, so now we need to head over to the gun store, any ammunition. And when you get over here, you just need to equip any parachute bag on your parachute, and make sure that's equipped. Also this does work with any parachute bag, so it doesn't have to be a certain parachute bag for this to work. So for me, because I'm from Little Old Australia, I'm going to equip the Aussie parachute bag. Now the final step for this video, you need to head down to the mask store and fly up above it. Jump out of your flying vehicle, whether that be an oppressor or a helicopter, and parachute your way down and you want to land right on the bench out the front, and spam right on the d-pad. If you get into the menu and you're able to save your outfit, then you've nailed it. Also just a pre-warning, I messed up this part three times trying to record this. So if you do mess it up, it does still work. You can just try it again and then, as you can see, you should have the black duffel bag on your outfit. I hope you guys enjoyed. I hope you guys liked this one and it helped you out and make your outfits a little bit cooler. So thank you guys for watching. Drop us a sub if this helped you out. And uh, I hope you enjoyed. We'll see you in the next one.